Hi, I'm Bill, and I'm 63 years old. I'm an endurance athlete and semi-retired engineer. I live in Bothell, and I uh, train four marathons and triathlons about six days a week, and I work uh, part-time four days a week. I found out about progressive performance through uh, pop up on Facebook, I'm not sure how that happened, but uh, I showed up in my feed one day talking about the sweepstakes and I had been contemplating my need for personal training and it seemed like a perfect opportunity to get some some training and, uh, and also uh, learn something. So the last few years I've been running two or three marathons a year. I added triathlons a couple years ago. Uh, I do a lot of swimming, biking, running. Most of those things are prone to repetitive stress injuries and uh, not being adequately strength trained uh, makes me more viable to injuries. So getting proper uh, technique and strength training seemed like a, a good thing to do. Progressive performance uh, is, is like a small community. Um, I've been to a CrossFit before. It's not like that at all. It's more of a small close knit group of people. Uh, small group of trainers and uh, it's almost like getting individualized personal training one-on-one -on -one, but without the, uh, the pressure um, and working in a group makes it much more uh, amenable. The, uh, the coaches, uh, I've never not gotten attention when I needed it and I've been able to work on my own when I needed that so I really appreciate that. The first thing that Jimmy did when I got here was do a, do a movement assessment to find out where I had deficits and strength assessment and gave me prescriptive uh, warm-up exercises to do which were meant to help with those, those limitations. Um, being 63 years old and coming to becoming an endurance athlete late in life, I started at age 57, um, I have some issues with shoulder, the back, me. Um, in, in each of the things that Jimmy gave me to do were unique to my physiology and my limitations. So that's been a great help. Um, and then in the general flow of the training program, uh, I've, I've been learning the specific movements I should be making when lifting weights um, and trying to overcome some of the things that are more likely to cause me injury. So the coaching staff here, um, I've interacted with both Jimmy and Tori, um, and they both bring different strengths to the table. Uh, Tori is also an endurance athlete. Um, both are involved in uh, powerlifting and proper strength training. And then nutrition-wise, um, uh, both have contributed to my uh, better understanding of what I need to do to uh, achieve my goals in weight loss and fat loss. So I came in with some pretty specific goals. I wanted to lose 20 pounds and I wanted to reduce my body fat by 4 to 5 percent. And I'm, I'm well in the weight of that. I'm not there. I've made progress. Um, the other uh, thing I've already mentioned is uh, wanting to learn to strength train properly and build strength. Uh, I've noticed a big improvement in my lower body uh, because I haven't properly strength trained lower body before. I've, I've made attempts at it, um, but even though I'm not running right now uh, and I'm doing a little bit of cycling, um, uh, the strength training I've done has really made a big improvement. I feel like just walking around. So the community here, um, both the human and the canine community, um, I really enjoyed petting the gym dog. She's a lot of fun when she's here. Um, she loves being petted, and you can always go over there and reduce some stress uh, in between sets and give her a, a little bit of loving. Um, it's fun to watch her carry uh, dumbbells around, too. Um, but the people uh, are very supportive. Um, uh, besides the coaches, I've had uh, you know positive input on my form and uh, technique from several of the members of the gym, uh, and I really appreciate that. Uh, they stepped in and, and gave me uh, constructive input as well as uh, encouragement. Uh, I know I, 
I did a couple things that were new mistakes, and people were quick to tell me that everybody does that. Don't worry about it. So, um, one of my fellow sweepstakes winners uh, talks about the lack of intimidation that she has experienced at other places. That doesn't happen here. Everybody uh, is here to accomplish their goals, and they're supportive of your goals. So that's been great.